who's gonna drive you home tonight? I'm Casey Cashel, and this is the Drive Home Show, everybody. Welcome. It's Monday. Hey, this I listen to a Drive Home Show from Ma- Monday. Was it a Monday? This morning it was from April 17th or something and in that show I listened to Drive Home Show from February something. So and in the February something show that I had reference to from the April something show that I listened to that one they uh, they had to go to the gas station and get gas and today I have to go to the gas station and get gas the gas light came on this morning on the way in I'm at 412.4 miles on the mile meter I probably could make it all the way home. I probably could. But, well, yeah. Um, what do you think? What do you think? Should I go for it? Should I go for it? Little bit then? Smart alky calling fish. We'll see. We'll see how the roads are, how the traffic is, and such the like in the Iraq and the such as. It is 76 degrees. It's uh, Monday. It's what? What is it? Oh, it's July 1st. What the heck? What the easy? It's July 1st. Nothing. It's July 1st. We're already the first of July. It's cloudy. It's overcasty. It's not raining. It's humid. Um, yeah. So we got a lot of stuff to update you on from the weekend, from Friday, because we didn't have a drive home show. Friday night. We're just gonna we're just gonna go ahead and go right in front of these people. It's a empty uh, merging lane or on ramp lane, but this car, come on, dude, this car's gonna. I kind of cut off this truck, but really, he should have slowed down. This car, I don't know why you're gonna go 40 on the on ramp, dude. Come on.
so I did not run on, on Friday. I did not run on Saturday. I did not run on Sunday. I did not run them here or there. I did not run them anywhere. I did not run green eggs and ham. I did not run them, Sam. I am. 413. <laughs> She's real keen, my 413. Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, 413. I think we're just going to drive all the way home and, and get the gas at the Four Corners. I've got my Cub Foods, you know, Cub Rewards card if I were having to go to a holiday store, gas station, crustacean. But um, I don't want to stop and get off the freeway and then take all that time to get gas and then get back on the freeway and then go home. And so like, let's, let's just get home. I think I've got enough. I mean, the gas light just came on. So, I should be good. I should be good. Usually, like, when the gas light comes on, like on a other car, you got, like, 50 miles or whatever. I mean, whatever. It's still above the E. But the, the arrow pointer needles thing is still above the E. So. We're just going to go for it. Um, so I updated you with running because I didn't run, really. I did pick up a armband phone holder at Walmart over the weekend. Um, yeah, I don't know. I was look, well, Paulita was getting new workout gear. And I went over and looked at the shorts, the running shorts. They do have like a zipper clothes pocket, but it's on the back pocket. And I'm not too sure how I would feel about running with my phone in the back pocket. I'm just not too sure about it. Then so I said, oh, let me just go check for an armband. They had one, $10 it's all smartphones and so I'm like okay I'll try it I didn't really like the way it felt like it must be for like skinny armed people because um, I can barely fit it on my arm okay and I don't know I'll just, I'll try it today. If, yeah, I think I'm going to run. I'm pretty sure I'm going to run today. Unless it's downpouring by the time I get home, which I don't think it is. I don't think it will be. But it is muggy. I'm not really looking forward to it. But I have to. I have to because I did not run Friday. I did not run Saturday. I did not run Sunday. So I need to. Then I, I ordered, I, I upgraded my phone. I did, did it today. It shall be coming tomorrow. I just pulled the trigger on it. I got the I, iPhone XR, iPhone XR. Um, we'll see how it goes. Really, it's Christina, my daughter, kind of talked me into it because she's doing it. But she texted me to say like she was going to get a new carrier, get it, whatever, get her phone off of my, um, my plan so that I wouldn't have to be paying for her and all, like, oh, I don't mind paying for her, but then she said she was going to keep, stay on the plan, but just send me the money every month for some kind of app. I'm like, okay, cool. And then, so then I started looking at upgrading. I'm like, I, I really wanted to get more memory. 100, 128 gig for doing videos. Because every time I do a video on my phone, then I try to upload it or save it or do all those things. It says not enough memory. Not enough memory. You gotta go delete some of your stuff. Not enough memory. So I got 128 gig. Paid fifty dollars 
more to get the extra memory. So we'll see how that works. We'll see how it works for the camera and the drive home show recordings. We'll see how all that works. It would only be better, really, it would only be better than what you're currently experiencing. Looking at, oh, looking at the songs that are popping out on the radio and uh, the 70s channel. There's like all these weird things like ride, Captain, ride upon your mystery ship. And like, eh, nah, well, we, might, well, we won't play that one. We won't play that one. All right, so we're coming up to White Bear Avenue. That means it's time to go over the twin scores. I'm ob obliterated. I'm explicable. I'm inexplicably inexplicable. Uh, they made the um, they made the All-Star Game selections, right? Twins best record in baseball for a good portion of the season. Only have two players going. Jorge Polanco, who was voted as the starting shortstop. And then they had, let me just tell you, they had C.J. Crone in the finals for first base. They had um, Eddie, Eddie Rosario in the finals for outfield. They had uh, Nelson Cruz in the finals for D.H., and then Polanco in the finals for the shortstop, right? So four twins in the final voting. I don't know. Let me just read. Let me re-explain. They did a different process this year. They had stage one. They everybody votes for whoever, and then the, the top three get to go on to the next round, right? So they had four that made it to the next round. I just named the four players. Jorge Blanco got voted as the number as the starter, but the other three didn't. And then the only other twin to get picked was Jake Odorizzi. Okay, um, what about Eddie Rosario? What about Max Kepler? Max Eddie Rosario's batting like 280, 20 home runs, 60 RBIs. Max Kepler's batting like 260. 21 homers, 53 RBIs. CJ Crone's batting 274. 17 home runs, 52 RBIs. Nelson Cruz is batting 280. 16 home runs. And I'm not sure of his RBIs, but they're close to 50. And he missed two weeks on the injured list. None of those guys got picked. We got Mitch Garber. Well, he wasn't even on the vote, but he still was, could be considered for a roster spot. He's got, what, 12 homers, batting 300. Got Byron Buxton batting 260, 279 homers. And he was uh, on the injured list. None of those guys made it. Uh, Jose Barrios, 8-4, 2.8 ERA. Um, Kyle Gibson, 8-4, 3 point something ERA. All these guys got snubbed. The White Sox have three players that made it. Indians have three players that made it. The Twins only get two players that made it. Talk about your all-time snubs. Hey, we're coming up to Rice Street here. This freeway was closed over the weekend. I'm going to look. This morning I didn't really pay attention. Now I'm going to look and see if anything is different what they did over the weekend here because they had it closed. So usually when they close it, 
they tore down a bridge or they put up a bridge or something. I still see the original Rice Street Bridge up. So that, that was not torn down. Okay, here's a second bridge. A second bridge, ladies and gentlemen. They put up a, a new bridge here over the weekend. I didn't catch that this morning. Oh, they did, they did put new um, girders or whatever for the, the original bridge that they kind of collapsed, defeated. So yeah, they did all that. So now they can work on the bridge in peace without interrupting traffic. So, sorry for that little side note. Um, twins, I can I can do you tell you the Twins scored the last three games. I'll go backwards. Yesterday they lost four to three to the White Sox. Not happy at all about that. They're pitching uh, against. They're facing Giolito. You probably know that Giolito is he's, he's ten and two and a two point eight ERA. Although his last couple starts were not stellar. And then the Twins brought up Lewis Thorpe from Australia, Rock, to make his Major League debut. And you could say they're basically throwing this one away, basically throwing this game away. But they, that's what I said when they did that for Smelter, and we won that game, I think. Smelter did good. He didn't allow any runs. Freeway time is 35W. Five minutes and ten minutes. Five minutes and ten minutes. It's 425 right now. If we play our cards right, we'll get to the bridge at exactly 430. See if we can do this. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. Remember, we're going to the gas station. Um, so, yeah, it, 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 we tried that with Smelter. It worked out pretty good. I think we won the game or he didn't lose it for us. I know that. But, um, so, Giolito held the Twins to one hit in through five innings. Come up to bat in the sixth, and the storm comes. Just major storms. Closed the airports. Scott Jr. couldn't go to New York. From out of Chicago because of all the storms. So, it was a ra three hour rain delay. They came back. And of course, Giolito's not going to pitch. So we're down two to nothing. We got four innings to tie the game. So I'm going to make sure this car doesn't pass me. I just, yeah, I'm just doing that. I can see him out of the corner of my eye. I'm trying to talk at the same time. Um, here's a major slowdown. What do you think you're doing? Iowa plates. I'm gonna let you slide because you're good Iowa plates. But oh, is this is there rain? No, there's no rain falling on the windshield. It looks like the ground is wet with raindrops, but that's not true. It's an, it's an optical conclusion. 426. We are past Snelling, but we got to slow down. I think we can make the five minutes. I think we can because we didn't slow down way back there. Where's that car that was trying to pass me? I, I didn't even pay attention to which one it was. I just didn't want them to pass me. And so they didn't. Um, what was I seeing? Oh yeah, so the sixth inning, we got four innings to get two runs and at least tie this game, right? So the first, the first inning that comes back after the rain delay, we don't do anything, go all one, two, three. And then they bring in Tyler Duffy. What does he do? He gives up four straight singles and allows two runs to score. Now it's now we're losing four to nothing. So then what do we do? We get a bunch. We we get a walk or a base hit or something, and then um, a two-run homer by Nelson Cruz is 16th of the year. Now it's four to two. I'm like, uh, if you would have just not let those two runs score, we'd be tied now. Then we get another run and make it four to three. But okay, we still got two innings to tie this game, and we're only down one. And what happens? We don't score. We lose four to three. Very frustrating. Uh, the game before that, Saturday's game, uh, we just kind of beat up on the White Sox. 
that was a win for is it oh Pineda Pineda got the win um, Sano hit a homer Nelson Cruz hit two homers somebody else had a homer dude. okay we're really we're, we're gonna cross over 35w and it's only 428 so we beat the five minutes by a mile we beat oh, it's just changed to 429 so we beat it by one minute I will go to Silver Lake Road Silver Lake Road Silver Lake Road all of the time did you know the smash burger closed on silver lake road i didn't know that did you know that i didn't know that i found out over the weekend um so who else homered sano homered cruz homered twice was it okay let me look it was like, oh kepler homered kepler homered twice Nelson Cruz homer twice. And they just clobbered the White Sox. Pineda got the win, and I don't care who got the loss. I don't really care. The game before that, though, that was the one I'm really bothered by. We had Jose Barrios pitching, and they had Detweiler or something like that. A journeyman starter who's been bounced around team to team he's been in the minors blah 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 and pretty much held the twins in check the only he gave up a two run homer to Sano but Barrios gave up four runs and so we're still losing four to two, and they're keeping Barrios in because, oh, we had this big 18-inning uh, game, uh, and now everybody's tired, and um, nobody can pitch because they can't pitch more than, and so he needs to give the bullpen the rest. Uh, uh, and uh, so still we're losing four to two comes like the 8th inning um, they still have Barrios in there and he gives up 2 runs in the 8th to make it 6-2 to two. and they kept saying oh Barrios did a great job he did a great job I'm like no he didn't he gave up 6 runs that is not a great job he gave up six runs. Only three were earned. But he gave up six runs. If you're going to be that shutdown ace, you need to stop them. You need to hold them at whatever. If, it's, if you're losing four to two, you need to not let them get any more runs. Oh, he did a great job. No, he didn't. So then Sano hits another home run in the ninth. Two, the second two-run homer in the ninth. So now that's four to, to six to four. We would have tied it if he held them scoreless in the eighth. But no, we lost. We lost the game. So we lost two out of three to Chicago. That's really aggravating. the game before I don't remember if that was Friday's game I think it was it was it was a day game against Tampa Bay Rays it was a getaway day and they started in a, that was that Friday though no it was Thursday because well I was listening to it on the way home, wasn't I? I can't remember. But if 
I, if it was Thursday, then you didn't know the final score, and they lost in, this, in the 18th inning. But here's the thing about that game. It was a 2-2. Two two. It was Twins scored two runs in the first. The Rays scored two runs in the second, top of the second. Then nobody scored again for eight, for seven, 17 innings. And then the Twins brought in Kyle Gibson to pitch, and he pitched 17th inning, and he got him out one, two, three. And then he didn't pitch again. They're like, why do you bring in a starter? Why do you bring in a starter if you're just going to have him pitch one inning? I don't understand that. And so they bring in Ryan Starper. Brian Harper, Ryan Harper, who um, just pitched the last previous two games, and they didn't want to pitch him three games in a row. And then, sure enough, yeah, he gives up 17 runs or whatever. He, gave, you know, it was like three runs or something. I don't know. And then we lose. So we lost three out of the last four. But we haven't lost three in a row, though. I've not lost three in a row, though. Four thirty-five. We're almost to the gas station. I think I'm going to get the Cub Foods chicken. Should I go back to this Cub Foods over this side and get the Cub Foods chicken, or should I just go by the house and get the Cub Foods chicken? What do you guys think we should do? Coming up to the gas station. You got till I get gas to decide. Go online, cast your boat. I'm just gonna go right here, you know, and I'm gonna back out. That's what I'm gonna do. Okay, let me give you some music. Alright, we're filling up now. We're 434. Point nine on the milometer. We're resetting it. Boy, you guys, it is so muggy out there. Just, I checked with Siri earlier when I walked around the path. Um, the six. The dew point is 68. That's nearly tropical. That's nearly tropical. My hands are down you. I didn't leave a hand on you. My eyes adored you. I'm like a million miles of me for me, my new girl. And I have adored you. So close. She close and yet so far. My eyes adored you. Yeah, amazing what phones are, what, what phones can do these days. Can you imagine? When I was in high school, there was no, there was no such thing as a phone, cell phone. There was no such thing as it. Um, that it wasn't even, it didn't even exist. There was no such thing. And I, you know, that's 30 years ago now, but. I have 34, 34 years ago, 34 years ago since I graduated from high school, but imagine what phones are now, and they're, I, di I just, hang on, let me give you some. Alright, I'm back. Good tune by the ELOs. And I'm back, you know. Because I don't want to go forward and have to turn left onto the Centronol. Centronol. No, no, no. Don't know what I'm going to do. I guess I'm going to the Fridley Cub. Slow down. Slow down. Run, run. You got me surging. No, not raindrops. On a one-way street, touching, flashing, 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 flash
What can I do? No, 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 don't know what I'm gonna do. Oh, oh, oh. I gotta get back to you. Oh, slow down. Slow down. Sweet talking mama. Slow down. You got me running. Run, run. You got me searching. Hold on. Hold on. Sweet talking mama. Hold on. It's so sad if that's the way it's over. Doom, 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 doom. Slow down, slow down, sweet talking bowman. Slow down, you got me running, run, run. you got me searching. Hold on, hold on, sweet talking bowman. Hold on, it's so sad that that's the way it's over. Slow down, slow down, sweet talking bowman. Slow down, you got me running, run, run. you got me searching. Hold on, hold on, sweet talking bowman. me that was all me all those different voices I went high I went low I went medium that was all me there was no there was no um, overdubbing it was just all live it was all live it was all live now, I forgot what I was gonna say even crap Oh, the phones. Yeah, I've done that too many times. But the phones, I'm just thinking because I'm getting a new phone tomorrow. I'm getting an X, iPhone 10 R. But the phones are like, they're tape recorders, right? They're like Sony Walkmans. They have they have your music. But they're not just Sony Walkmans because you don't play a cassette tape. You play like every single, every single song in your library and then some. Any song you want, you can play on your phone. They're, they're TVs. They're, they're VCRs because you can watch videos. They are recording studios. Garage band. They are alarm clocks. You can set them and set the timer and wake yourself up. They're phones. You can talk to your, you can talk to your sweetheart. Or you can talk to your best friend and teach them how to do the Rubik's Cube. They're video phones. You can see the Rubik's Cube. They are... What, are, what else are they? They're more than that. They're more than that. Oh, they are video... <coughs> They're video cameras and cameras. video cameras but they're not like crappy video cameras they are good video cameras with good video capabilities and good sound capabilities they are video editing video editing machines contraptions they are video game consoles. We got this new little thing called texting that there is no comp comparison. There is no other machine or device that's comparable. You could type something and send it to. You can write a note. You can write a letter. They're like passing. They're like passing a note in class, but you could do it from wherever to wherever. You know, 
What are you doing? You can't walk out on this. Hold on. Hold on. You got me running. Run, run. You got me searching. Hold on. Sweet talking about Hold on. It's so sad. Could be a radio because guess what? I could listen to satellite radio on my phone. That's a radio. I can listen to that. I can listen to the American Top 40 while I go run. That's another thing. And they didn't have a they didn't have a um, comparison of this. It tells you how fast you're running while you run it. It keeps track of your speed and distance while you're running and it tells it to you while you're doing it. What? That's crazy. That's amazing. Just think, and then when I was a kid, when I was a teenager in high school, we didn't have any of that. We had none of that. We had none of it, all right? Another thing you can do, you can do. You know what else you can do? You know what else you can do with your phone? You can go punch up something, order a double cheeseburger value meal from Burger King, and somebody will bring it to you. Somebody will bring it to your door. That's what it can do. Could you do that with your cell phone before they had cell phones? I don't think so. I don't think so. All right, what is this guy doing? I want to want to uh, get in their parking spot. There, da. I want to get in. Da. I'm just gonna go here for crying out loud. Looks like a busy day at the grocery store today. Oh, great! Oh, there. Oops, we don't want to go in third gear. We don't want to go in neutral gear. Okay. Just making sure this guy isn't going to park in pulling my spot. 75 degrees piano, man. I could sound just like Billy Joel. Anyway, that's it for the drive home show, everybody. Thanks for listening. Keep your feet in the ground. Keep reaching for the stars exactly 40 minutes. Bye.